Ooh, oatmeal. My favorite. Thanks, Mom. Ow, that feels really hot on my tooth. Maybe some cold milk will feel good on my tooth. Ooh, that's so cold. Okay, this apple isn't hot or cold. I should be able to eat it. Yikes, this is too hard. I guess I just can't eat anything this morning. Hurry up, Matthew. We can't be late for school today. You have a test to take, and you haven't brushed your teeth yet this morning. Why do you think Matthew had pain when he tried to eat his breakfast? He has a cavity, which is very painful. Do you know why a cavity is so painful? It might help to understand more about the different parts of a tooth, called the anatomy of a tooth. The outside layer of a tooth is called enamel. It's hard and protects the other layers from bacteria, food, and pain. Dentin is the next layer. It is hard but porous, which means it has small holes. It can't protect the inside of your tooth if it's exposed. The pulp is the soft center of your tooth. It has nerves and blood vessels that connect your tooth to the rest of your body's nerves and blood vessels. The root is the part of a tooth that is below the gums and helps hold your tooth in place. Cementum is the hard covering of your tooth roots. Gums are the soft tissue that surrounds your teeth and helps hold them in place in your jaw. The jaw is a bone that holds your teeth. When someone has a cavity, the enamel is missing in that spot. That means any food, drinks, and even toothpaste will touch the sensitive parts of the tooth, making it painful to do just about anything. Since the tooth pulp also has blood vessels, a cavity also means the bacteria can get into the rest of your body from your mouth and can cause infection. Healthy teeth help your whole body stay healthy.